I know what our next race is, and uh, I don't know about this, Chief. Eleven. I was definitely, like, just staring at the screen, waiting it for do to do stuff. Oops. Alright, so our next IC Max uh, series is this one. <laughs> this one might be, uh... an idea. <laughs> Boomer Cup. I cannot act upon that idea because I don't have enough money. Alright, I think this is one series where we're not going to be able to actually like uh, stick with the theme of the series and I'm just going to have to use a, a car. As much as I want to use a classic car, I'm not going to be able to. Okay, here's how I'm going to do it. I'm just going to use one of my cars for the 246, and then I'm going to buy a uh, one of those Murica cars. So we're just going to cheese race one, because I don't really have a choice. Do I want to use the Copperhead? I kind of actually do want to use the Copperhead. You know what, I'm just going to use the Copperhead for the first race. <laughs> Fuck it. Yeah, fuck it, let's just go. I'm sorry, do you mean concept car? I mean Copperhead Survivor, because that's its fucking name. Thank you for the reset, though. Hey, look, guys, I can meet the horsepower requirement now. Wow. Fucking fuel injection. Yeah. What Reaper said. That's what makes modern muscle better. Alright, so we're gonna cheese this first race and then we're gonna get an actual, like, old car. So. Fuck it. Tahiti Road, let's go. Tahiti Cheese. Uh, it definitely does not count. It has a historic car in this game. This was a concept car from the 90s. In a game released in 1999. Yeah, my favorite classic car. Oh, look at this competition, though. We have Stratos, we have... That, we have a couple Dotsons, we have a Fiat 500. Power. Might have been an Elan in there. I don't know. It was one of the small, slow cars. So yeah, I kind of feel bad about this cheesing this first race, but it's okay. The other two will be infinitely more difficult. Don't worry about it. I think you're fighting a losing battle here, Saab. Eh, just a wee bit OP.
Honestly, it actually is keeping up surprisingly well. I'm a little bit surprised about that. Yes, Harry, that's what I've been saying for a while. <laughs> But my opinion is fact. Are we do GT4? Uh, that's for me to know and you to find out. Okay, well, we got the throwaway race done. <laughs> Yay. Fair and balanced. So, Stratos was sec. No, it was a Subaru 360. Had a Lotus and Land and two Dots and 240Zs. 240Z, 240ZGs, excuse me. Good names. Subaru 360. Alright. Cool. Man, we not got a new car. Actually, I want to see what this new car is. Could have worn that 240Z. I could have, but could I have won the other two races in the 240Z? That is the question. Also, I did. It was expensive. I had 30 grand, and that thing cost 23 grand. You have to. You have to keep in mind, I'm, I have a limited budget here. Wait, I got... I got a Mugen CRX from that. That's not old. Okay. Sure. Alright, anyways, uh, we're gonna buy a car now. And, uh, what the fuck was I gonna get? Not here. Not sure why I was thinking Plymouth, but that wasn't it. Get the 4K. No. There we go. The Cougar. That's what I wanted to get. Mercury Cougar XR7. 319 horsepower. It actually looks really elegant in black. dark blue as well. We're gonna get this in black. Will this go well? Absolutely not. Good night. God, fuck my ass. I was just kidding. I'm cautiously optimistic for TDU uh, Solar Crown. Fine, I'll get the Challenger. I didn't want to get the Challenger because people in chat were telling me to get the Challenger, and I hate when people do that because, oh my god, plum crazy. Alright. I'm sold on the Challenger. We can get in plum crazy. Let's fucking go. Gotta love the flavor text. I'll just get in Cotter now. Possible. You didn't convince me the color did. Don't take this as an open invitation to tell me exactly what to drive all the time because I will start fucking hammering people. I swear to god. That shit's really annoying. If there's one thing that pisses me off a lot, it's backseat gaming. Anyways, I'm getting sport tires because uh, I'm driving a large car and I'm going to need grip. So let's see if our Plum Crazy Challenger can actually win this. We're at, going to Rome next. Okay, GT40 is not here. We actually have a chance. What's that? Fucking gay. 
I can go in our atrociously geared uh, Challenger. <laughs> First try, let's go. Only took, like, what was that? One extra reset? To get rid of the GT40? Because, uh... Yeah, if you get the GT40 in this race, <laughs> fucking say hi to second place. Ah, ah, ah. God, third gear is so long in this thing. Mostly these sport tires aren't helping me much. I mean, they're probably actually helping. I couldn't imagine how terrible this thing would corner without them. Shit. Fuck. Leans. Oh, here comes a Stratos. It's okay, I did it once in Call of Duty and that was a massive mistake. Oh my god. I immediately regretted that decision. Get the fuck back behind me. You're, you're not you're not cucking me out of the wind here. Bitch. Okay, you might cut me out of the one here. Just kidding, I sneak. Oh, he's gonna get the crossover. <laughs> Fuck. Oh, hello. That'll load us Europa. I think it is. I kinda forgot about that car. Send. Dirty driver. Don't mind me. Pardon me coming through. Okay, this is actually going to be difficult. Ah, you bastard. Get the fuck back behind me. Go. Nice and smooth. A little slow. No blocking needed. Alright, cool. We're gonna win. <laughs> yeah. We did it. Good god, this thing needs a tranny. I hope I can afford a transmission upgrade for this thing, which is fucking hell. Oh, there's a skyline in this. Stratos, two E lands, and a Europa. Europa ended up last. Whoops. Ripped and torn. Just like my PP. I mean, what? I win. Get credits. I get car. I save a replay. I need to delete a replay. Okay, because I've already got thumbnails on this shit. That's definitely the wrong number, but I don't give a fuck. Oh shit. Okay. Well, I'm not as good of a gamer as XTG. Also, he might have, like, messed with stuff in the game. Who knows? Okay, so, Grindelwald, 394 horsepower. See what I can do with the Challenger. Gundeveld. Let's see. 
How much? That's the differential, not transmission, idiot. I don't really want a close ratio transmission because this thing has shit top speed anyways. Okay, fine, I'll spend 10 grand. I don't want to spend 10 grand, but I'll spend 10 grand. Guess who's a broke bitch after this? It's me. Me, Austin. Ah, fuck it, might as well. I, I do have a large car, so... Fuck it. Ocus Docus. Well, let's see how our finale of the, uh... Historic Car Cup goes. Probably terribly. Let's find out. Grindelwald. 394 horsepower, let's go. <laughs> this thing's gonna fucking lean, it really is. Alright, let's check the uh, gear ratios on this. Okay, I guess I can't check the gear ratios on this. Fuck. Damn it, I was really hoping I could get a graph. But, uh, it doesn't look like I'm gonna get graph. Okay. Let me just extend these gears a little bit. Alright, so we may be screwed here. Um. Car looks like a nightmare to drive. It's just a thick boy. We can at least do stage one re weight reduction. Stage two, not so much. Okay, I want to see how much weight this thing has now. Also, we've got a Lotus Europa from that last race, alright. Yeah, it's still thick. <laughs> okay, let's give this another shot, and, uh... If worst comes to worst, I'll just sell some of these prize cars, because I have a lot of them sitting in my garage. I'm not going to make a lot of money off of them, but... Alright, so... Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take a sacrifice here. Okay, hopefully a sacrifice that actually has some monetary value. Sure. Lock the Lupo. Goodbye, Lupo. I had a Clio's worth five grand. Sell the Clio. Alright, now I have 17,000 credits. After uh, that second place. So, you know what we're gonna do with that 17,000 credits? You know what we're gonna do with that? We're gonna give this thing some sticky boys. Shit. Okay, we're gonna get them slightly less sticky boys. I wanted to give them the really sticky boys, but uh, I guess we're just gonna give them the... Yeah. Because uh, this thing needs grip. So, uh... Here we fucking go again. I really wanted to get the super softs because, like, it's even softer than the softs. All the grip. But nope. Alright, what do we got this time? Well, we got this Shelby Daytona again. I think the GT4 is starting third. Or GT40, excuse me. I was correct. Go. Grip. Grip. What's up, Quay? Okay, I, 
have some good Ibu now, but not enough. Go. Go, go, go. Alright, these tires are actually helping out a lot. At least subconsciously. Uh, I should have tu uh, tuned a little more top, si top speed into this thing. Why is racing transmission still fucking reaches or has a top speed of 120? I'm a genius. Oh, that was bad. That was really bad. Holy shit. Alright. The fast boys are still stuck behind the slow boys, which is also helping immensely. <laughs> like, it's not just the tires helping me here, it's also everyone else. It's so hard because they had very soft suspensions. And they were very heavy, so a body roll. More or less a suggestion. Yeah, that. Uh-oh. Oh boy, here comes the Daytona. Shelby. I hear him. That's a wall. Go away. He's here. Oh fuck, here comes the GT40 as well. Let me just miss every single fucking uh, corner here. Come on, get a good exit, get a good exit. Go, they're a little slow through this section. Is that as an advantage? Am I gonna make it? Am I gonna make it? Am I gonna make it? Please? Oh fuck. Oh god. Oh shit. Yeah! Okay. Yeah! We beat the OP cars. In a challenger. <laughs> In a thick boy. It's fucking good. Oh god. Alright, that was fucking hard. <laughs> Did I say the replay of the last race? I hope I did. Take that, Carol. Fucking no par, new car. Let's go. Holy shit. Alright. Oh, fuck. Alright. Whew. Challenger was a good challenger. Har he har he har. Oh man. That was a pain in the ass. But it was a fun pain in the ass. And there we go, historic car cup. Done. Yeah. <laughs> uh fuck. Uh, Alright, well at least that's taken care of now. Let's take a better look at all of my uh, prize cars. So first we got this Mugen CRX. Which I really like the looks of. And we got a Lotus Europa. Fuck yeah. Thing's interesting. And then we got this thing. Celica con XYR concept. Forgot this was a Celica. Get the Lupo and the Cleo back. Nah, I don't need to. A 20 PK 
back to Europa. Does it? How much does it sell for? Oh, it does sell for 20k. If I feel like it. So, there we go. Well, that didn't hurt my win percentage that much, at least, so. There's that. We're at 15%. Historic Car Cup is done. Yeah. And I think there's one more IC Max Championship I can do. Ooh. I don't know what it is. 